Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Ron's Keto Cafe and I'm Ron. Well today we're exploring Miriam Ave in 2023 with our 2023 Hyundai Elantra. Today is an overcast day, partly sunny, the sun started breaking out as soon as I uh, took the uh, car to another field trip today. Today we're exploring Miriam Ave. We, as you recall back in 2020 we did many of these roads and of course a lot of stuff changes over the years and uh, so today is no different there. This is uh, this particular area they're just passing the Gallagher building on my left hand side there. I used to go to school in that building over there back in 1970. Today it's used for the uh, number of different office buildings including the Historical Commission office which I'm a member of and the uh, school committee uses one of the floors and they get some other office buildings over there along with the local radio station. So now we're just cruising along at cruising speed at about 30, 35 miles an hour. They were trying to keep the speed down low there because uh, with the new Hyundai Elantra there, it's really, you know, don't, you know, you're just barely putting your metal to the pedal and you're cruising along there. And then it came across a yeah, red light over here and then I'm stopping over here. And there's a particular intersection over here and just kind of like follow me along, you know, just keep the... Uh, voiceover going as much as I can and in between I'll pause and just let it, the uh, video just roll along and uh, I believe this was uh, Washington Street I was just crossing over I'm not really sure if you, but anyways uh, just follow me along over here on the left hand side we uh, that used to be Honey Vibes and that was a different name at that convenience store over here on my left and that used to be uh, Family Pizza and now with the, uh, they have a little uh, dessert place in the morning where you get desserts and name is uh, Simply Sweets I believe anyways uh, we'll have the correct information on the return trip there and of course as you're driving along now we got to pay attention to the uh, road and uh, yeah so it's going really good guys I just enjoy doing these videos for you and I ended up buying a, buying a road cam dash cam video and days it's really sunny and bright I get a lot of solar glare and sometimes a perfect day to go out and do these days are on overcast days and so what have we got going on this weekend yeah we got to track the parade we're going to go and probably do some filming and I have a wake and a funeral to attend that same day so it's going to be a little bit of a rough day for me that day and uh you know we do the charity on Friday nights and then on uh Sunday we have a, a, a get together with the uh volunteer crew on the uh, parish that we volunteer on on Friday nights. So as we continue on with the uh, trip there, just bear with me on this. And uh, yeah, I hope you've been enjoying these videos there. I really enjoy doing these Road Dash videos for you guys and, you know, thinking back on what I can possibly remember uh, to put up some of these videos and uh, just keep going along with, with the ride and enjoy your day. Again, here we are in the middle of October, and as you can see in New England, some of these trees are starting to change color, and uh, in another week or two, we'll be at full peak colors, and it's really great to go out and get some photography and uh, video in some cases, and uh, yeah, so this coming weekend, we have the tractor parade on Saturday, I'm going to go out and film some of that, and uh, I have uh, same day, I have a wake and a funeral to attend, so it's going to be a pretty rough weekend coming up, and uh, just so you know, when I chance I can, when I'm out on the road, I'll hook up the uh, dash cam and uh, just go down and explore the road as long as I'm out. Now we're coming across over here, um, the end of uh, West Street over here to my left and the start of uh, Linda Ave over here to my right. And then, of course, if you go down there and take a left over there, you'll be down to my favorite walking place, uh, which I go down there many, many times. Uh, the Doyle Estate and uh, Upper Ab Ab and there's a parking, uh, plenty of parking behind and the uh, on the left hand side as you just pass in the uh, office of the trustees over there that he uh, run the Doyle Estate. So and then uh, as we traveling and traveling along there we'll be coming up to the route to uh, highway over here on the right hand side and uh, we're going to come up to the Twin City Plazas which is formerly the Kmart Plaza over here. When, uh, you know, blast from the past, I suppose. Uh, this particular uh, area, Route 2 over here, sometimes it's really, really hard to get out from area map side there, and I uh, kind of wish I would really, really uh, reconsider this area for a set of lights in, because it's really, really difficult, especially in the, you know, late afternoon. And, uh, you know, I'm surprised there's uh, not any more action is there than there really are uh, in, in the past. 
So now we're going to come up to the set of lights over here, and this is going to be just about the end of uh, Miriam Ave from the uh, traveling along from the right hand side of the road over here, and uh, again over here the uh, Twin City Plaza. We'll go down and explore that area another day. Maybe I'll throw up some past photographs of what was there in the past. And uh, you know, I used to work at the Hannibal's over there on the right hand side. I, I, I thinking about going back to Hannibal's for a part time job, but. Right now, we don't need the extra money. We could use it, but as long as I'm able to keep up with the inflation, we're really doing fine. I just have to be vigilant and watch what I spend and try to stay away from using the credit cards when and when and all possible And because uh, you never want to use the credit cards unless it's for an emergency. So now we're just doing the uh, return trip and uh, let's continue to check along over here. And, you know, over here on the right hand side near one of those houses was the Louis Chapeter house and Mr. Christmas there. He used to put all kinds of great uh, displays out every Christmas before he had passed away back a few years ago and uh, they still put up his displays at the uh, Festival of Trees in the city of Lemister there around uh, the end of November. The uh, trees go up in the city hall and it's beautifully lit up and uh, definitely be going down there doing some video and some photography this year and, and like I have done in the past and uh, yeah, you know, we lost everything in the flood as far as all our Christmas stuff is concerned and uh, a lot of our valuables and all my winter gear so and my fishing gear and all that stuff there so we'll definitely have to be picking up some new uh, Christmas stuff this year. We've already started to uh, pick up some stuff yesterday at the uh, our friends from the uh, Walmart family. Yeah, Walmart's is a great store. I don't care what anybody says. There's, I know they're getting a lot of heat for a lot of different things but you know, you got to Coal where you can make your best deals on you know, like Targets and Coles. I mean, Coles is a little pricey, but they do have good quality stuff at Coles. I love Coles too, and I'll shop at Coles on occasion, and uh, I don't have an issue paying a little higher price for a little better quality. So now I'm at the uh, traffic light, just waiting for the crossover there. And this particular lane, you could be in either lane to go straight there, but typically when I'm going straight, I'll be over here on the left hand side when I can get over here on the uh, safely when I could just go when the light changes. So now we're just cruising along again at around 30, 35 miles an hour and I uh, just really enjoy doing these videos for you guys and uh, yeah and uh, let me know if you uh, live locally and you want me to go down and explore any roads now. They have, uh, I noticed yesterday they finally have Main Street open to where the uh, sidewalk done. They, they extended out one of the sidewalks and they put a new walkway in to make it easier for people to cross across the street over there in Main Street. I think probably later on this week we'll go there and we'll go all the way down Main Street and explore that and go all the way up to the Fitchburg Limister line and uh, swing the car around. Now we have uh, Main Street and then we have North Main Street. So sometimes I get confused when I'm traveling on those roads. I travel on these roads so many times and I don't even think twice about it when I'm going on these roads in Lemister and there that this road is just was recently done a few years ago and you know and uh, every now and then they'll uh, tear it all up and they'll uh, you know put a new code on here but uh, I don't think they'll do one of these uh, this particular road probably for another year or two but I did notice on some of these side streets that they've been tearing it up and doing some of the side streets which is really really good um, I'm so proud and happy to be part of Lemister because, you know, at least our mayor, you know, he's an awesome uh, guy, uh, Dean Maz and uh, Mazzarella, and uh, being mayor for 30 plus years, and of course he, he'll definitely be mayor again for the next two years. You know, we take care of our city, we take care of our people here in our city, and, uh, you know, uh, he's got a really hard working crew there, you know, you know can't run without uh, you know a good crew behind you and and of course all the uh, city volunteers that uh, put these events out for us to enjoy and uh, yeah so and uh, again he, he puts out a lot of great local events like we just had the cannoli festival and now we get the tractor parade of course the Halloween parade next weekend which I won't be able to uh, film obviously going down to Foxwoods and uh, you know unless that gets canceled and uh, yeah, so like again, we're cruising along at top speed over here at 30, 35 miles an hour. And uh, my name is Ron, and I uh, just enjoy doing these videos for you. Oh, yeah, I meant to tell you before, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Yeah, over here on my right hand side, there we're just passing the former uh, family pizza area location that was there for many, many years. And, uh, you know, I just really enjoy uh, doing these videos again. And, uh, yeah. 
So really fun uh, doing these and uh, just enjoy your day. And by the way, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, again, thanks for watching these videos. And I'll continue to put out some more of these videos and explore parts of New England on the fall afternoon day. And hopefully we'll get some good fall colors as we're you know, going through some of these areas. What's great about these road dash videos, you know, you see a lot more from a road dash video because when you're driving, unless you're the passenger, you, you don't really notice it much. And so when I'm driving, I can't look at these, uh, you know, what's to the left and right of me because I'm paying attention to pedestrians and, uh, you know, making sure I don't go over the speed limit, make sure I stay within my mock lanes and stuff like that. So anyways, again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed these videos. You guys have an amazing day. Oh, don't forget, again, I know, I know I'm saying same old record. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Love you guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay vigilant, and enjoy your day. And this concludes our Miriam Ab uh, right along with Ron.